Assalamu alaikum dear students, how are you? Hope you are well by the grace of Almighty Allah. Welcome to NIBS Home School. This is Lokman Hussain, an assistant teacher of English, National Ideal English Barson School Deshi. Now I am going to conduct an English class for the students of class 7. Our today's topic is Sin Comprehension. It has been taken from English for today, Unit 6, Lesson 5. Uh, in, in this lesson, in this passage, it has been discussed about a journey by train made by Jishan, Julie and their parents. Let's see our today's discussion first. Here you can see a picture of a train. It's a Bangladeshi train named Tista Express which is bound to Kamlapur to Dewanganj. Can you see the picture? Have you ever made any journey by train? Actually making journey by train is it makes us happy, it gives us freshness and it also gives us pleasure. So whenever you will get time, you can make a journey by train. It will fresh you. Let's see our today's passage. Read the text first and then choose the best answer to the following questions from the alternatives given you. You do not need to reproduce the whole chunk of the answer. Dear students, this is my first class we do for annual examination. At the end of our today's class, I will provide you an SW. So please keep watching our today's video at the end of our class. Here, Jishan, Julie and their parents, Mr. and Mrs. Arif Khan got into a first class compartment at Kamlapur railway station. It was Devangon's bound Tista Express. Where? Devangon's bound Tista Express. The train left here, left, look at the word left, left comes from leave. So it's a past form of leave. The train left at 8 o'clock. Jishan saw the departure time on the big timetable at the station was 7.30. However, the train was running quite fast. How? Quite fast. That quite is used as an adverb. Quite means very, very fast. The children sat by the window beside their parents. The compartment was half empty. The compartment was half empty. Okay. Yesterday, Julie downloaded a beautiful poem on a strange journey by Robert Louis Stevenson. Yesterday, Julie downloaded a poem which was written by Louis Stevenson. Okay. She took a printout of the poem. Now, while looking out of the windows, she found similarities between the poem and real scenery. She took out of the poem and began to read. In this passage, you should underline specific information and keywords and the strange vocabulary so that you can answer question very easily. Now you will have MCQ. Let's see MCQ. Choose the correct answer to each question from the alternative given and write the corresponding number of the answers in your answer script. First number. Mrs. Arif Khan got into a first class compartment at Kamlapur railway station. Here compartment means, what does compartment means? Here three, four options are given. First number, house. House, it can be the meaning of compartment because house is a place where we live with a different types of families and a lot of houses, a lot of rooms. A set of rooms which where we live is called house. So it can be a meaning of compartment. Second one is division. Division, it comes from divide. Division or divide means distribution. So it can be the meaning of compartment. Third one is room. Room denotes a place. So third, last one is apartment. Apartment means a set of building. So according to the passage, Compartments is the closest meaning of compartment can be room. So give tick mark at the question number C. Option number C is your right answer. Okay, number two, the train left at 8 o'clock. What does left mean? In our passage, we came to learn that this left comes from the present form of verb leave, which means to departure. Okay. First one is departed, second one is when, it can be the meaning of left because when is a past form of go. 
C number relinquished, it also mean, it means resign. Number D forsook, forsook means to give up. So, the appropriate meaning can be only departed. Okay, third number, the meaning of the word quiet is according to the passage, we got this word from here that however the train was running quite fast. So, quiet is used here very. So, quiet is the meaning of quiet is very. Four number, the word found means found, it comes from find. Find means to search or to see, etc. First number established, it can be the meaning of found. Number B make, number C build, and the D number is notice. So found is past form and notice also past form. So it is the closest meaning of found. Okay, number B, I mean five number, the word station means station is a place where vehicles comes and starts and stops. So, station can be a terminal also. So, looks and search the options, check the options. First one is terminal, B number displays, C number move, D number remove. Here appropriate meaning can be terminal because displays means fire or sack. C number move means to go here and there, remove means to erase something. So, appropriate answer should be terminal. Number six. The poem Julie downloaded was written by Julie downloaded a poem. The poem was written by Louis Stevenson. According to passes, the poem was written by Louis Stevenson. Number seven, the children took their seat by the window. Through you can see the picture. Can you see the picture? Here parents show their children outside scenery from their cabin. Is another picture. Children sit by the window of their train. So the children took their seat by the window. Beside where? Beside their parents. Beside their parents. Here you can see the parents. So beside their parents should be appropriate answer. Number eight, the train was moving. The train was we came to learn that the train was moving quite fast. So fast. The train is moving here. How? How the train is moving? Slowly? No. Gradually? Step by step? No. Swiftly? Yes. It should be swiftly. Swiftly means very fast. Next one is the word journey means. What does journey mean? Visit? No. It can be the meaning of journey because visit means to see others as usual meeting. Number B, journal. No, it can be because journal means daily newspaper. Number C, traveling. Yes, this is the appropriate meaning of journey. And journalism is a name of a profession who works as a, is, is in a daily newspaper or journal. Last one is the word read means. Read means utter. No, utter means to sound loudly. Memorize. No, act to do something. Parius. Yes, this is the appropriate meaning of read. Okay, we are at the end of our today's class now. Now you can pause the video and you take your HW copy. You have to write this some sentence in your HW copy. After this passage, if you have the book now, open it and go to model question 17. In this 17 model question, you will get another passage and throughout this passage, you will get some questions. You have to answer this question, that will be your HW. First number question is, where did Jisan's grandparents live? B number, how was the night? Number C, where did they sit? Number D, why did everybody clap? Last one is, who got the first prize? So this HW topic has been taken from model question 17, exercise number 2. The, these are the question, short question, you have to write answer. So I hope you have understood our today's topic. Our today's topic was a passage, sin passage, which is about a journey making, made by Jishan, Julie and their parents. They took a first class ticket from Kamlapur rail station and they went to Dewan Ganj. So this is all about our today's topic. Keep practicing at home, drink a lot, 
Stay home, stay well. See you soon. Allah Hafiz.